to address the news of the COVID relief deal that has come from Washington. I have long said that we are facing a three to four trillion dollar moment and that history will judge us harshly if we undershoot this moment. Certainly, we are happy to see the House and the Senate come to an agreement, one that will offer some relief for working families and small businesses, extend the deadline for the investment of CARES Act funds into our communities, and provide some funding for our vaccination efforts and our schools. But at $900 billion, we are undershooting, and no one should fall into a false sense that the job is done. It is not. This is no time for half measures, and we cannot keep finding ourselves back at the beginning once each round of support dries up before the pandemic is tamed. We need to keep working. Our families and businesses need more. Our communities and our fellow states need direct support. So yes, count me as grateful for this agreement, but do not count me as satisfied with it. 